five years. They will finally rematch here tonight. Round one is underway. McGregor, Aldo, act two, your thoughts. I mean, it can't live up to that. The moment of the first fight, when Aldo went down, McGregor jumped on the fence, you understood that this was just something different. That would never happen again in mixed martial arts. How do they top it? They're about to attempt that right now. He is all about that left kick to the body. Well, you saw the tail of the tape. He has a reach advantage and made good use of it there with that punch. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Oh! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got a pressure. He's got to chase that finish down now. Just misses there with the left. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Oh, that's a big connection there for McGregor, DC. I mean, big strike landed for Ireland's favorite son, Conor McGregor. I will no surprise the striker has come out at his aggressive best here early. Really throwing everything with fight ending intentions. He's throwing everything to end the fight, and he has to. Because the longer this fight goes, his opponent has the advantage. Big kick land. So 28 total strikes and counting have now landed for the King of Rio, Jose Alba. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Beautiful level change. Anytime you are in a ground fighting situation with this fighter, you're potentially playing with fire. Aldo's attempting to pass here, but he's denied by the defense. Working off of his back here, looks like he may try to hip escape. Aldo's got the full mount. Oh man, this ground and pound is good. Probably my favorite striking realm in MMA, and he's as good as it gets. The problem is his opponent is not controlling his posture. He's allowing his opponent to get up and when he does, he creates this space to land these beautiful ground and pound combinations. All right, working out of side control here. His opponent trying to control posture, but you got to be careful here. All right, so you got to be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't want to mess around for too long. All right, so pretty good damage here with the ground and pound. Nothing superficial about these. Very accurately, and he's landing to get damage off. Aldo's right back to the full mount. And they both stand up. Oh, how good is that jab by Aldo? Man, that hurts to watch as he lands another strike to his opponent's liver. He has continued to target that area after landing that huge liver shot earlier in the fight. A little cut below that left eye. Aldo gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Back and forth we go! Beautiful land there by McGregor. Made it look easy on that issue. He is such a diverse striker, but he's very tricky in the approach when he's trying to land that left hand. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Oh, beautiful straight right hand. Yeah, he's mixed it all up. He's hurt. He's hurt bad. Now he's on top of him looking for a finish. Good movement by him here, transitioning very well on the ground team. Steph's going to start looking to try to attack a rear naked choke, and that's exactly what he's doing. He is doing a really good job of relaxing, not panicking because he's getting choked. Yeah, notice he just took the body triangle, readjust the lock, and now it looks like he's got it. Absolutely, he finishes his opponent by way of submission.